welcome back to another Wild Willows video here on the Wild Willows YouTube channel. How are you all doing today Wild Willows? I hope you're all doing good and I'm actually doing another sit down vlog. This is going to be a review one so I'm going to be do doing a review on the Dragon Roller Coaster at Legoland Windsor Resort. Um, I have actually been on the Dragon Roller Coaster. If you have a look at my Legoland Windsor vlog um, I did um, a couple of months ago you'll see it all on there if you just have a look on the Wild Willows YouTube channel and uh, yeah if you want after this <laughs> but anyway make sure you like comment subscribe turn on the post notification bell so you'll be updated when we do a new video like this here on the Wild Willows YouTube channel also follow us on Instagram and Twitter at Wild Willows and let's get on with the Wild Willows video it is a really good ride as you can see but a little bit short there's two kicker wheel lift hills on it so yeah I really do like it um probably um um one of the best roller coasters at Legoland well it's the only roller coaster they have really so um yeah as you can see it goes down that steep drop well I won't say steep then into a tunnel um, what I think of the dragon, it is a really good ride, really do like it, so um, yeah, it's, it's really good, um, it's just a bit short in my opinion, the track designs, I mean the trains are really good on there, the train designs for the dragon, I really do like them, it's like at the start, if you sit right at the front, you've got like this Lego dragon on the front, so I really do like that, but um, yeah, and first you like going to this like, like indoor bit, and it takes you around like, Scotland Scottish stuff like um I don't know like dragons and stuff so it's quite good it really is quite um good really do like it and um <clears throat> yeah it is a short ride in my opinion I won't queue over an hour for it if it's on five minutes get straight on there because so, um <clears throat> it's worth riding if you do go to legoland i'd say that's probably one of the first rides you head to if you go to legoland winds of the dragon so um yeah it's, it is a short ride um so um yeah but it is really good for the kids for them um, to get the first coaster out of the way so um yeah it's really good i really do like the dragon at legoland windsor um lot of theme lot of theming but there's not a lot of theming in the queue lines i think it'd be better if you put some like theming in the queue lines because there just isn't enough really there's not not really nothing to do so it'd be nice if you could put some like posters and stuff up so um yeah i really do like it um um probably one of the best coasters at legoland um <clears throat> not the best coaster in the world definitely not <laughs> um we're not comparing it to vampire and stuff no <laughs> but anyway it is a good ride really good for kids um and for toddlers or babies well probably not babies on it but even for little little kids we do have um, a coaster next door that's called the dragon's apprentice so that's like the toddlers and stuff so they can overcome their first fear and it's just like the dragon just a bit more shorter and slower so um yeah um, really good it is um the dragon if you ever go to um Legoland Windsor, I um, highly recommend you check it out. When you first get into the park, I'd head down right there first because it does get queues over 70 minutes. So, um, yeah, but anyway, guys, that's the end of the video today here on the Wild Willows YouTube channel. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification bell so you'll be updated when we do a new video like this. Follow us on Instagram and Twitter at Wild Willows. Vi uh, wild willows and i will see you on the next wild willows video bye bye